Hello all, and welcome to another video brought to you by Trucky1701. I know in my last video I told you I was going to be doing a Mystery Science Theater 3000 review, but um, the truth is I have not gotten the chance to watch any of them yet, and all the new st packages that I ended up uh, buying. So um, instead, today I wanted to talk to you about um, TV Westerns. Um, and show you some of the things that I ended up getting today from Amazon.com and um, the first is The Virginian now um, this was not as popular this series was not as popular as Bonanza or Gunsmoke but what makes this western different than um, the other westerns that came out during this time was um, that this one episode of this series last or or lasted an hour and a half including t commercials and it was the only TV it was the first and only TV c series to do that so um, that alone um, really was uh, different from any of the any of the other westerns that it were on TV at the time. Um, this lasted for like nine seasons um, and um, and it had a I guess it had an okay run. Uh, this is season one obviously and uh, the package alone and it's a tin package and uh, I'll show you the side here that's the side and uh, that's the back and usually when you see these tin packages they look really chintzy and uh, you know not really well done but I actually enjoy I actually like this package a lot and I'll tell you why uh, first of all you just open that up and the lid comes off like this it's that, it's that. and then on the inside you get a book or you just pop it out and um, it looks just like a plain book like you would see in a library and um, then you open it up and what you'll see is that the DVDs are let's see if I can show you a good one see it's just like a book it opens up just like a book but if you notice the DVDs are right there. Um, don't know if I really like that or not yet. Uh, kind of hard to pull out of, but uh, the packaging itself looks good, and uh, I really like the idea of it being like a book almost. So I thought that was kind of neat and different from uh, the other stuff that's that I've seen out. And. Um, so I am really looking. I have not watched this yet, but uh, I've seen. Uh, if any of you out there have had uh, have subscribed to the Encore Movie Channels, um, they have a Western channel, and they do broadcast uh, the Virginian on uh, that channel, that particular channel. And uh, so that's how I discovered this series. Uh, it wasn't through anything other than that. Um, but uh, I bought this and I guess uh, I just went to uh, TV shows on DVD.com and I discovered that Steve, they are releasing season two of this series in December so I will show you that as soon as I get it. For my next uh, series, Western series, I bought this not really knowing anything much about it. I didn't even know that Steve McQueen had done a TV show, let alone a Western. Um, and what what was interesting um, this was uh, a recommendation by Amazon.com that was given to me and uh, what I found fascinated was all the uh, famous actors that are, had appeared in this series it's a black and white series um, and it only lasted for three seasons and you can pick up the invid they do have packaging for the individual seasons if you want to buy it that way but I bought the complete collection which I'm not sh too happy with on the inside the outside packaging looks okay but um, there's the back 
there. But uh, the inside looks really chintzy to me. No uh, backboard, no no uh, pamphlet, no booklet, nothing. And what makes this set really chintzy to me is they don't even give you disc holders to put your discs in. What they give you instead is these flimsy little uh, CD slip cases that you can buy at your local Walmart for like 10 bucks. And so I'm not too happy with the with the product itself, but the episodes I'm excited to watch themselves because they, like I said, they've got a lot of famous actors. And I think that that's one of the reasons why I really enjoy collecting classic TV Western series. They just seem to have everybody in them, um, whether it's Bonanza or Gunsmoke or like a show that didn't last very long like this. Uh, some of the guest stars in this are uh, Michael Landon from Bonanza and uh, Highway to Heaven, um, DeForest Kelly, Dr. McCoy from Star Trek, um, James Colburn, who actually, if any of you out there have ever watched the Magnificent Seven movie, Steve McQueen and James Colburn are both in that movie and I guess in this series as well. Uh, there's even an episode with Mary Tyler Moore guest star, uh, guest starring in an episode, believe it or not. Um, and there's like, I think there's like five episodes directed by Richard Donner. Now, for those of you who may not know who he is, he directed, uh, Lethal Weapon movies and the first two Superman movies with Christopher Reeve. Um, so I am just really excited to watch this. Like I said, I never knew this series existed. And when I checked it out on Amazon, it just seemed like a really good deal to me. So, and the next series that I wanted to show you, and I hope that many of you might pick up based on my recommendation, is, well, let me show you here, Gunsmoke on DVD. Now, what I really like about this series is not only the famous actors who are, you know, come and go in, you know, almost every episode, um, but um, what I really like about this series is it's only a half an hour long, but it, it really reminds me of what made the original Star Trek series so great in that it was like they gave you a great story with a nice message to it. And, um, you know, they really, uh, it just seemed like the storytelling was superb in these early episodes. These are the early black and white episodes. I do not have any of the colored episodes on DVD, DVD yet. Uh, but I, if you uh, if you are into classic TV shows or westerns, I highly recommend you buying this um, because, quite simply, uh, I'll just show you here. This is the first season, obviously, and uh, this is the back. And uh, now the. The bad thing about these Gunsmoke DVDs is the fact that they have, this is uh, Season 2, Volume 1, um, but what makes these kind of, the, these Gunsmoke DVDs kind of skimpy is the fact that they don't have any real special features to them. They just have the episodes. Uh, there are old cigarette ads in these, uh, in some of these DVDs, but this is uh, Season 2, Volume 2 by the way. Um, but there's really nothing except old cigarette ads, basically. So, um, which I don't mind, because quite frankly, uh, I, I enjoy watching the episodes themselves, and there's plenty of hours to kill watching the episodes themselves. It, you don't really need the special features. Uh, this is Season 3, Volume 1. And... Uh, this is Season 3, Volume 2. Now, what I also like about these DVDs is that you don't have to pick up a whole season if you don't want to. Um, these are really cheap. Um, now, these are really cheap, and uh, they, may, they split the season up because the seasons were so long back in the 50s and 60s. Um, a regular TV series 
season would last from, um, I want to say, September through almost till March uh, or May of that of the next year. So these TV series really last. This regular season really lasts a long time, and um, you know that's why they really split them up. They didn't do it. I know a lot of people on the internet, you know, are were complaining about the seasons being split up, but um, it is kind of a pain. I understand, but they're really cheap, and um, you know, I think they're they're worth giving a try to anybody who's interested in in watching these. Um, they're like I said, they're really inexpensive and uh, you know highly entertaining for my for my dollar. So anyway, that's really all I have to talk to you about. Um, the other thing is most of the TV uh, western series. Um, have a problem with being continued to be made uh, and what I mean by that is if uh, any of you have picked up the Big Valley series on DVD you know that um, they released season one in volume uh, one of season two but they've never continued to uh, to make the rest of the series onto DVD and uh, you know there's a lot of there's a lot of fear that, uh, or, you know, fear of, or within me, but, uh, that they probably won't not get around to making the complete series of Gunsmoke just because it did last 20 seasons long, and Bonanza lasted 15 seasons. Now, I'm happy to, to know that they are releasing season two in volume one of Bonanza on the DVD. I have the season one of Bonanza on DVD and uh, so I'm happy to hear that they are working on you know at least making season two of Bonanza but I highly doubt that they will complete the series before another distributor buys the rights to these uh, series and you know I think it's going to be like Mystery Science Theater 3000 DVDs where you know different companies distribute the different various episodes just because the series lasted so long. Bonanza lasted 15 seasons and Gunsmoke lasted 20. And like I said, the Virginian lasted nine. So you take that all to, into account and you've got a lot of DVDs that aren't out. So um, I hope you enjoyed this video as, I, as much as I enjoy talking to you about these uh, classic TV Western shows. And I hope that uh, you enjoyed it enough that you'll go and try some of these uh, DVDs out. So uh, I will be back with another video and uh, hopefully thanks for tuning and thanks for subscribing. Talk to you later.